Hello, my name is Steve Bigelow with the Candlestick Forum. Because of the visual aspects of uh, candlestick signals, you get a lot better impressions of when the markets might be topping. Now, we know there was a rut row. We know there was a resistance level up here that the uh, Dow had hit a few times before. So what did we want to see if this was a good, strong price move? Wanted to see it get through that level. However, the shooting star signal told us there was weakness at this area. That gives us a little bit more of an advantage to say, all right, maybe they're not going through. We should be much quicker to close out some long positions if the market starts trading lower tomorrow. Same scenario on the NASDAQ. A doji right here at this resistance level. Even though we're not in the overbought area, the uh, current trading is telling us, well, there's a little bit of indecision up here. So this makes for very easy trading tomorrow. The doji rule, the price will usually move in the direction of how they open after a doji. So obviously, if it opens lower, they're going, not going to go through this level. There's other indicators that also you know, illustrate what's going on in investor sentiment. One of them is the high yield corporate bond index. You can see it did a bearish kicker signal today. Now, remember the high yield uh, corporate bond index is if investors have confidence in the market, that means they've got in or got uh, confidence in the uh, bonds that uh, those companies hold. When they start selling those off, that's another indication that confidence is starting to wane. That becomes one indicator. And the fact that the bearish patterns, like CrowdStrike's dumpling top, is indicating obviously there's not any uh, uh, bullish sentiment occurring in the, uh, the, the uh, big trading stocks that everybody likes to trade. Well, if this opens lower after Seeing the dumpling top after the gap down, after the bearish doji sandwich, double doji uh, sandwich. If this opens lower tomorrow, we got a doji sandwich in progress, kind of confirming the dumpling top. Remember, a dumpling top is the opposite of a fry pan bottom. If you see start seeing strong selling, that means that selling could be pretty strong. Today, we did some uh, put and put spreads on this anticipating if this dumpling top works, they could bring it all the way back down to this major support level. So remember, the dumpling top's the opposite of your fry pan bottom. We recommended CVRX because of the fry pan bottom, best friend breakout. Now remember, there's other aspects that investor sentiment uh, takes into consideration. We could see it was a fry pan bottom. We could see that it did a best friend signal but everybody else was watching to see what it was going to do with the 50 and the 200. That tells you when they started buying, it's because they had confidence it was coming up through those indexes, making an upside potential of coming up here and filling this gap. So when we start seeing more bearish sentiment, when we start seeing strong sell signals and confirmation, that means if you're seeing better sell signals than you are bullish signals, that's probably telling you that investor sentiment is starting to get a little bit squeamish. If you see gap downs because their earnings were good, but their outlook was bad and they're getting obliterated, that's another indication investor sentiment is going south. So anytime we see something like this where they're gapping something down, expect more downside. So these type of charts can be identified immediately because of our chat rooms where we've got hundreds of pairs of eyes looking for the same type of signals and patterns. Even if, not even, if you're a day trader or a swing trader, when somebody in the chat room says, hey, take a look at XYZ, it's breaking out, you may not know when to buy or most people don't know when to buy. However, there's just a simple technique. You go to your 10 minute chart and 
if it's breaking out, you can be buying, you can be buying, you can be buying. Maybe you're not buying in here, but you're buying in here. Notice your morning star signal in your doji sandwich. And where did it finish up at the end of the day? Up a huge percentage. So do we catch all of these? No, but when you have a chat room where everybody's looking for the same type of signals and patterns, you're going to be able to participate in these type of trades. So come join us. We always have the two-week free trial. This allows you to see the logic that's built into candlestick analysis and taking that information where you've got some, a lot of experienced traders that uh, identify the good trades. And if you're just learning candlestick analysis, the chat room is a good place to greatly expedite your learning curve that if you see something or somebody says, look at X, Y, Z, it's got a good breakout pattern. If you don't want, know what the pattern is, you just ask. And you'll have plenty of people that will help you understand why that is a high probability trade setup. So with that, looks like we're getting a little bit toppy. Just be prepared. That'll be it. We'll see you in the chat rooms.